Hey, what's up, everybody? How we doing? Hi, Mac. Hi, Keelan. Hi, Hacker. What'd you guys do today? How's your day going? I want to hear. You know, one more minute, and then the show begins. While we're waiting, if you could, make sure you're following the channel, and make sure you're subscribed. I, you know what? I'll say it. I hate the non-subs. Also, hi, Alex. Make sure, guys, the GOAT is live. Use your channel points. Ask me anything you want today. Ask me anything you want, and I'll answer truthfully. Yeah, I will. Hacker said, I ate breakfast? That's pretty sick, man. You know, filling your belly in the morning, that's what your body wants and deserves. You're on spring break too? Even better. I bet you had a hot pocket for breakfast. Um, Keelan, ask your questions with your channel points. I thought the directions were very clear. You know, I swear to God, some of my viewers are actually stupid. Oops, clearly the directions weren't clear. You know what, Keelan? You're in big trouble for that behavior. How do I time out? You get a 10 second timeout. I'm sorry, my guy. I don't condone this behavior in my chat room. Not my first time out. Learn how to read, bozo. Okay, I think I've stalled enough. You know what? It's time for the show. Who's ready? If I don't see a single person type 1, I'm never streaming again. And I'm not even kidding. I'm willing to give up the fame and the fortune for this bit. Okay. Are you guys ready to see how I upgraded my stream setup? Yeah, look at this. <laughs> Dude, I, I cannot be a character actor. I can't do it. Okay. You know what, Peason? Compose yourself. You're live on Twitch. To 5,000 viewers right now. You can do this. Good morning. Good afternoon. Hello, everybody. We had a Keelan, Hacker, Mac, Alex, and Hart in the starting soon screen. Thank you guys for chatting. Serious stream today. I'm here to make an announcement. <laughs> Serious stream. Serious stream. You know, I've been streaming for three years now, just about three years, two months short, and I've found a lot of success, and I've come to a point in my streaming career where I think it's time for the student to become the teacher. So everybody, the GOAT is going to be answering all your questions about how to be a pro streamer like myself. So put your questions in the chat room, use your channel points, and I'll answer anything you ask. We did have a few people pre-submit on social media. Thank you to all who did. Let's go ahead and jump into it. <laughs> this is giving alpha oil? No, it's not. This is my real personality. Also, I would like to clarify. I do have a sponsor today. Check out my sponsor overlay. It's pretty sick if you ask me. 
I had to beg and plead to get these sponsors to shill. So guys, exclamation point. God damn it. Exclamation point sponsorship and chat to check out our sponsors for today. I need my water cup. Now, streaming is a hard job. Yo, is that your chair in the back? Yeah, of course. That back there is my gaming setup. This right here is my streaming setup. You know, I'm so rich that I got two computers, two laptops, two phones, and two private jets, which are parked in my backyard, of course. <laughs> So, how today is going to work, we had... God, fuck. <laughs> VOD watchers skip like five minutes. Okay, I gotta make sure my bald spot doesn't show today. That's why I'm wearing my hat. As you know, all popular streamers are balding. Okay. So... We're going to go ahead and go through my pre-prepared questions, and then we'll go with viewers submitted. So watch till the end to see all your questions answered. First off, oh, also to clarify, um, I did make graphics for the questions, but my editor didn't submit them in time, so they're still downloading from my Google Drive. So, editor, put the images here in post for the questions with sick graphics and explosions. <laughs> Sorry, I can't. Okay. Also, guys, if we hit... If we hit our sub goal today, I will dye my hair live on stream. Yes, sir. All the hairs are remaining on my head. <laughs> this voice hurts. <laughs> Not the bald with the ponytail? You're being ableist. You're making fun of my genetic disparities. Mods banned them. Okay, first off, we had Kobobo on Twitter ask, how long should you stream when you're first starting out streaming? Well, when I first started streaming, I did not find success very quickly. I only stream for two hours, three times a week. So you know what? Only six hours of work? That's barely a part-time gig. That's barely a part-time gig. That's like working at the fair during the summertime. So my advice to you, Kobobo, to you personally, is to click go live every single day and stream eight to ten hours. Because you know what? If people see that you're live, they see that you're grinding, that you want to become partner. So, you need to put the hours in. Splatoon music? Ew, I hate Splatoon. You guys know this. But VOD watchers will not hear the music today. Okay. <laughs> guys, put your questions in the chat room below. Or, it's here. Okay. <clears throat> Next up, we had Winfer ask, what equipment do I need to start streaming? Well, when I started, I streamed for my MacBook Pro 2017, and my streams were, I'll admit, dog shit. So, I spent $2,000 plus upgrading to an Alienware M17, fit with the number 17 on the case, and sick RGB lights. And you know what? They match my setup now perfectly. And I think it was worth it. But... Honestly, you probably just need a decent camera, some ring lights, maybe one or two. I got two right here. I look kind of washed out, but you know what? It's fine. And I know everybody says get Elgato, Elgato's the best, but you can find some cheapy capture cards for like 20 bucks on Amazon. Hashtag not sponsored today. I do have an Amazon sponsor lined up next week, so guys, make sure you submit and buy things for my wishlist stream next week. I need to stop giggling. This is a serious stream. Serious stream. Okay. Next up, we had Andrew Drew25 on Twitter ask, how do you set goals? I personally am not a goal person, but one, my one single goal in life the past three years was to become a successful streamer. And as you can see by my crazy setup and my wicked hat, 
I am successful. So, you know what? <laughs> okay. I didn't prepare my answers. I'm fully improving, you know? I'm so smart. Honestly, don't give yourself too many goals. You probably got enough stress on your shoulders, and your backpack for school is already probably so heavy with all those textbooks. So, just give yourself one goal. But make it a super unattainable goal. That way it weighs on you so much that it'll encourage you to work harder. That's right. Okay. <laughs> Next up, we had Rod Tina ask, how do I make myself relatable to my audience? As of recent, I've seen a lot of success with streaming. I'm a, I got my sick setup on my RGB lights in the back. I do feel like everybody has the chrome tableware in their kitchen and RGB lights in their bedroom under their bed. And you know what? I don't like it. So to make myself more relatable, I personally fill my whole setup with... Wait, <laughs> let me reset. Let me reset. <laughs> reset. <laughs> okay. <laughs> God damn it. The bit is ruined. <laughs> okay. What was I saying? <laughs> okay. I'm usually a pretty tidy person, but to make myself more relatable, I make sure to keep trash all over in my bedroom. Because, you know, the one clip of Asmongold and XQC popping off because they had so many takeout boxes in their bedroom. That's how you get views, guys. By keeping trash in your bedroom. I'll be honest. Looking around my actual setup, besides this prop trash behind me, I only- Okay, actually, I do have two dirty plates in my bedroom. I'm sorry. I'm a fraud. I'm a fraud. Look. The trash, it's fake. It's fake. <laughs> Don't say ew in the chat room. I bet you guys also have trash in your room right now. If you don't- I want pictures of your bedroom. <laughs> okay, next up, we had Mac underscore underscore RC on Twitter. They ask, how do I get clout fast? Now, I hope you're asking this to be completely genuine. I really hope you are. I don't like people who joke around. But... If you want to get cloud fast, all you got to do is collab, collab, collab. You need to DM every single small streamer and large streamer and DM Ninja Blevins every single day. And then, once you collab with every single creator, you can leech off of their audience, fire so many clips, and then finally, leak DMs and farm drama. That is what you need to do to gain instant clout. I have yet to do this strat, but one day I will. I will. Whenever I build my fanboys to be so loyal, I will. I have one cup in my bedroom. See? You should be ashamed. Ew, what is this? Why is there so much Splatoon music in this com? I hate Splatoon. Next up. We had Orthmo ask, how do I be confident on camera? For me, I was really easily comfortable on camera. I used to have a full body POV for camera, which as you know, I'm plus size. So that's probably not the best decision, unless you're a hot tub streamer. So if you want to be more confident on camera, all you have to do is fake it till you make it. I'll be honest. I don't look at my camera because it scares me to see my reflection every single day. Talking about reflections, also to hype yourself up before stream, either talk to yourself in your viewfinder, or simply go to the bathroom and give yourself some hype speeches in the mirror. Because what's going to hype you up more than yourself? Maybe your parents did the approve you, but mine don't, because I'm a streamer. So, just fake it till you make it. <laughs> Next up. We had Mac underscore underscore RC on Twitter ask, How do I milk a lot of subs for my sucker viewers? Sunglasses emoji? Shaka emoji. Man, that's my signature emoji combo too. I'll be honest. 
If you look at my sub count right now, I got 200 plus subs. It's actually insane the amount of support I've had from my viewers recently. So, if you want to get a lot of subs from your viewers, all you have to do is pity farm. It's pretty simple. All you need to do is put some eye drops in your eyes and watch this. The tears flow and the subs come in. Also, making your sub goal. Wait, wait, wait. Hi, Electra. I mean, hi, Electra. Welcome to the chat room. How was your day so far? Why don't you go ahead and tell me in the chat? Okay. Another pro strat is to make your sub goal so huge. That way it's the first thing people see when they click on your stream. You know what? When they see it, they're going to want to add and explode that sub goal. Another thing that could help is putting the text for your sub goal being rent money, electricity bill because when people see that you're struggling almost in poverty they're gonna want to donate their whole life savings to you just like amaranth viewers man we're at seven thousand viewers holy shit guys thank you for the support today Next up, we had Andrew Drew 25 on Twitter ask, what do you love most about your family and friends? Now, this question isn't really about streaming, but I still kept it in. Because you know what? My favorite thing about having very little family and also very little friends because I stream so much in my day is to be able to leech off of them. Be able to tell stories whenever they do something silly or cute. And also, it's going to lead to me having a vlog channel one day, which is the epitome of content creation. You get to see my whole day from start to finish Whenever, and also you get to see the edited moments of when I'm actual. God, wait, I need to work on this bit. <laughs> and the best part is, the editor will actually cut out any times that I scream and yell and hit any of my family members. It's pretty cool. My viewfinder. Okay. Series stream. Series stream. Moonina asks, what should I stream on Twitch? Personally, I don't do this, but if you're just starting out, I think you should stream the most popular categories, which right now are just chatting, Valorant, and hot tubs and beaches. So just play a trending game and the viewers will flood in. And you know what? If that doesn't work playing Valorant for 12 hours a day, you can always just hop in a hot tub and gain tens to hundreds to maybe thousands of viewers instantly. Because we love Twitch. <laughs> Wait, this is the M64 song. Okay. And Loy asks, how do I get viewers? I know this is kind of like, this could be to... I hate my stutter. <laughs> now, Twitch Death, I want you to close your ears when, I, when you hear me say this. But if you want Vince, vi but if you want viewers instantly, all you have to do is pay for viewers. That's literally all you need to do. And also, you can have all your friends at work and at school have the stream open on their phones, their laptops, and their iPads, and also their Samsung TVs if they're rich enough to have it. That way, you gain the extra ten viewers every single day. You know, a lurker is worth one chatter. Wait, no. That makes no sense. <laughs> okay. And also, if you want to get more people to actually find your stream, all you need to do is post on every single social media platform more than three times a day. Yes, that's true. Three plus times a day. That way, every time somebody sees one of your posts, it's like an annoying... Chuck E. Cheese ad. You don't want to see it, but it the <laughs> You don't want to see it, but they keep shoveling it down your throat. And you know what? One day they'll actually give in and click on your stupid little live stream. When they can choose to watch me, peace and underscore 17 on Twitch. Live every day at 11 a.m. PST. Yes, sir. And if that fails, just beg. Bring back the eye drops, cry, people will come flooding in.
We've only had a good handful of questions left, so if you want your question answered today, use your channel points right now and I'll answer it live. Also, we're 30 minutes in the stream, so you know what? I have to run an ad. I'm sorry, but I gotta do it. And also, follow right now. I actually don't have to run an ad. I'm just farming for the bit. <laughs> okay. Hi, Slivion. Can we... Whoa, it's been a while since we've seen you. Sorry. I mean, why am I breaking character for this? Hi, Slivion. Go ahead and put your streamer Q&A questions with your channel points in the chat room. Welcome in. Next up, we had Andrew Drew 25 on Twitter ask, what is something that keeps you personally motivated? I'll be honest, it's gotta be the fame and the money. I do this for myself, not for you guys. I click a lot just to get that cash. <clears throat> Next up, we had R Kara ask, how should I title my streams? Keep it simple. A good, funny pun who bring in all the dad bots. And you know what dads have? Money. So they will give you so many subs and bits for your silly little jokes in your titles. Also, putting emojis between every single word works. I've seen XQC and Kai said I do it. And you know, you gotta be like the other goats. Next up, we had Trayton ask, I've had no viewers for years. What should I do? I'll be honest, man. If you've been grinding for years, just keep doing what you're doing. Don't change it up. Surely one day somebody will find you and they will love you. But if you've been streaming for five plus years, to be fully frank, quit. Like, if you've been on the internet for five years and nobody, literally nobody's watching you, homie, you gotta find a different hobby. Granted, it only took me um, uh, six months to get affiliate, and look where I'm at now. I'm at 8,000 viewers. Isn't that crazy? One day you could be just like me. <laughs> we've been trying to find the pink chatters. I think we've been scaring them away. <laughs> Okay, so that was all my pre-prepared questions. Let's go ahead and switch to viewer questions now. So guys, use your channel points and I'll answer your questions right now live for you. Just for you. First, we had NotMag0 in the chat ask, Should I multi-stream to other platforms and never interact with my viewers? Whoa, I feel like you're quote tweeting. No, goddamn. Whoa, I feel like you're subtweeting Ninja right now, and Ninja is my goat, so don't be so rude to him. Also, he has skin cancer, so stop being rude to him. But to be honest, multi-streaming has its perks and its demerits. It honestly is up to you. If you're the type of streamer where if you don't talk to chat, then it doesn't matter if you're multi-streaming. But if you like that one-on-one -on -one engagement with your viewers, probably stick to one platform. And I'm being completely honest with this advice. I'm not even joking. I would be scared joining the stream as well. No, Slimeon used to watch a lot of streams. They've been working. Guys, be nice. <laughs> <clears throat> Next, do it my point. <coughs> Man, I hate the stripper voice. <coughs> Whoa, what was that? It was that a ghost? <laughs> Dude, I look so red. I'm looking at my stream video. <laughs> Next up, we had Hi Hacker in chat ask, how do I get a bajillion views in five minutes? Now, homie, I think the most concurrent viewers we've seen on a Twitch stream was like a million, if even. I have to look at these stats, but it had to be e -bar. So I don't think there's any way you could physically get a bajillion people. There's not even a bajillion people on Earth. There's probably a bajillion bot accounts, but I think Twitch staff will notice that if you bought that much. So if you're gonna bot your viewers, I would bought maybe like 5,000 max. Next up, 
Next up, we had Keelan in the chat room ask, how do I become super rich and omega famous person by streaming? Now, this might be controversial, but the way to be a famous streamer is to not stream. It's kind of weird, huh? All you have to do is get famous on TikTok and YouTube first, and then bring all those viewers to your actual stream. Type 1 if you found me on a different social media platform. I bet I won't see a single 2, but you know what? It's fine. We have three questions left, everybody. Put your questions with your channel points now. I found you on Facebook Live. How'd you find my Facebook? What the hell? Seriously, what the hell? Maybe you're looking at Live Leak. Next up, we had not Max Zero in the chat room ask, is deodorant a must? Now, I don't understand what this has to do with streaming. I know I showed you guys the fake trash I had for my stream setup to make myself look more relatable. But honestly, if you live by yourself, you don't really need to wear deodorant. It's like kind of sick. Like, there's no such thing as smell-o-vision yet, so your viewers can't smell how musky your room and, your, and you yourself are. So deodorant, maybe a 50-50 depending on how you feel for the day, you know? Hot Cheetos with cheese? Hey, why don't you see that in my background? <clears throat> Our second to last question for the day is from Mother Electra in the chat room. They asked, how to be a girl boss streamer? Now, if you look at me, I don't look like a girl boss. I'm covering my balding head with my cap. So this is kind of a weird question to ask me, Peason underscore 17, but I think I can answer it. If you want to be a girl boss streamer, all you need to do is put your chat room into emote only mode and then sub only mode. So now you can fully segregate your chat room and be a slay girl boss queen. And now only the super elites can type in your chat. That is how you assert dominance with your viewers. So, look at that. They cannot chat. Isn't that pretty sick? You guys are free. <laughs> Before we do the final question, do we have anybody else who wants to submit a last-minute question with their channel points? We have one question left, and then we're going to end stream, and I'm going to go back to bed. Who needs three pairs of headphones? This is just a flex, honestly. And I do personally own two headphones besides these. These ones are just for show. They're not even headphones. They're made out of clay. I'll give you guys one more minute to submit more questions. It feels so weird looking at the camera so much. Usually, I'm just playing games on stream. I'm not used to being in the spotlight. <clears throat> the gaming laptop is insane. What do you mean? I have an actual PC. Look at that. Isn't it pretty sick? <laughs> Next question. We had not Max Zero in the chat room ask, is it wrong to sell crypto to my viewers? I understand there's like an ethical dilemma between you and your sponsorship. As you can see, my sponsorships are in the top right. And I know some of them are being boycotted right now. But you know what? I gotta get that bag. So, it's up to you personally. You may think it's wrong to sell crypto, but the crypto bros love it. I think it's wrong to sell crypto if you know your kids. Wait, I think it's wrong to sell crypto to your viewers if you know they're mostly kids. But you know what? Sometimes their L, wait, sometimes their L is your W. Why am I making fun of my sponsors? You know what, Keelan? You're getting another timeout for that one. Don't make fun of my sponsors. What the hell? They're in chat lurking. How dare you say that? Okay, do we have any more questions for me, the GOAT? <laughs> oh my god, sorry, the punching emote scared me. I thought it was the... 
I'm not used to having emojis in my background. It's so weird. Okay. The final, the ultimate question of the day is to a Florida queen. They ask, how do I figure out what type of on-screen personality I want to use for a stream? This one was very interesting to me. Personally, what you see on stream is actually me. I'm so happy and cheerful and blunt. I love being curt with my viewership. But you know what's really popular right now? Being a VTuber. Who doesn't love a cute anime PNG tuber with huge boobs? Who doesn't love it? Type 2 if you hate it. So, just be fake. Don't be yourself. Guys, I have something to confess to you all. I haven't been completely honest today. I don't have 6,000 viewers. I only have six. And you know what? The sponsors, they're not sponsors. They're not real. And the final thing, I'm not balding. I'm a full head of hair. I just wanted to be relatable and popular. Everybody who's popular is bald and wears a hat and has an RGB setup, but guys, guys, this isn't real either. It's just me in front of a green screen by myself in my room. I had to confess to my frauds. I don't have thousands of viewers, but I just wanted to help you guys today. I wanted you guys to think I was cool and popular. Okay, bit's over. <laughs> Happy April Fool's, everybody! Not you putting the green screen on your chair? I've done this before. You've seen this setup before. Okay, time one if it was a good bit. <laughs> I gotta fix my hair. The hat was pretty cool. Honestly, my head, even though my brain is huge, I feel like my head got smaller because that hat actually fit today. Welcome back. Yeah, I'm back in the green screen void. Why? Okay, sorry. I'm like hung up on like, yeah, of course I put the green screen on my chair. I don't want you guys, the, it wouldn't make sense. Where is the chroma key? It wouldn't make sense to like have the chair here, you know, where the hat come from. Actually, cool story. This, look, I'm back in my million dollar setup. This hat is, I got this in high school because my art teacher, he, he got gifted like 20 of these other, oh, oh my god, sorry, the chroma key, I had to color correct to like get all the green out of this. This hat is from Truth, oh my camera's flipped. So like it's the, it was a campaign from like the non-smoking company and like the hat looks pretty sick. So my art teacher, he went to a convention. He, he was gifted like 20 of these to pass out to his students. So like, I just got one. But I think you're supposed to like color this part in. But I didn't. I feel like this vid was just to give my first time out. You think I thought that far ahead, huh? Okay. <laughs> okay, obviously today's gonna be edited. That was fun. What do you guys think of this year's April Fool's stream? I definitely think it was better than last year's. Because the peace and bit, or the peace and bot bit was good. But I hated how I wasn't on camera last year. I feel like that took away a lot. <laughs> Back in the void. And you know what? I did not get any donos today either. <laughs> And you know what's funny? I was getting all the overlays. I'll explain. I'll explain all the overlays I used today. So, a little behind the scenes for the VOD watchers and the live viewers. <clears throat> that story was cool. Yeah, my art teacher is really cool. 
Um, obviously this is just text. Your mama's so fine. I was gonna put mama, but wait, I don't want to say that. <laughs> um, it's just, this is funny. This is the actual sub goal that I made like three years ago, but I never used. So this is how many subs I've gotten in the past six months. Isn't that wild? And then what else did I have? <laughs> the viewership bit? Okay, I thought of this bit this morning. Because if you go to Streamlabs, you can have an actual live viewer count overlay. I never use this. I think we peaked at eight viewers today. That's pretty good for a piece in stream, let's be honest. But <laughs> I couldn't find the same font. Because for some... Because in OBS, you can't like edit the text for some reason. You also can't change the font. It glitches out. So you can tell that it's not the same. <laughs> Guys, I have, a, I have a computer science degree. Uh, so that was that bit. And then, you know, I'm surprised nobody did more commands today. That was part of the bit. Um, the sponsor. Um, let's see, where's the overlay? This overlay, this is on Streamlabs as well. The actual parody logos are from an illustrator who made these... I found them from a Business Insider article. I could not find the actual artist link to where he has these artworks published, but it's like parody logos. And you can see McDonald's L. Huge L. I haven't had McDonald's in like six months. <clears throat> and then, what else? I was, for the actual questions, I was gonna have like a little pop-up speech bubble overlay but then i can't like edit it live because I, I was gonna like export gifs to like animate them in to have them slide in and fade out but then i was thinking i was like that's probably better to do in post like for an actual editor to do or me so i was because like once you put something in a stream you can't really edit it out it's really hard to unless you know like how to how to chrome wait no not chroma key how to Oh, what's it called when you edit out a background? Rotoscope. It's hard to rotoscope. And I don't I know how to do it, but it fucking sucks. So we're gonna have like um the chat as a separate overlay in the YouTube video. Um 5,000 viewers, holy shit. Also, I don't know why I did the Oh my god, guys. I'm doing this voice today. I don't know why that came out. I think it's whenever I wear that silly little hat. It kind of sounds like Brendan. The love of my life. And then, let's see. Do, 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 do. And then obviously, obviously I chroma keyed myself in the room. This is just like a royalty free image I found on Pinterest. And then, <laughs> the stupid trash bit. <laughs> I thought the trash bit was funny. <laughs> Yeah, so that was today's stream, a little bit of BTS. Okay, let me hide the sponsor overlay. I don't... I got kind of scared because, obviously, on Twitch, you have to disclose if you're sponsored. That's why, for the actual command, I said I'm not sponsored. Parody today. I'm not sponsored. Let's stay in my sick gaming room. And for the actual questions, it's flipped. But I did... Kind of like for the Winter Wishes stream, I did like prepare like what I was going to answer with. Yeah, that was today's stream. What do you guys think? Rate it out of 10. Be honest. Be honest. I literally just had deja vu. I'm scared. Also, look how red I am on camera. Ew. Ew. It was good. Thank you. Do you guys want to hear my other ideas that I had for April Fools? Let's see, I wrote them down. Eight out of ten. Let's freaking go. It was giving the people who do TikTok and YouTube Twitch advice shorts. I know. Dude. <laughs> it's so... <laughs> I used to consume so much Twitch tip content when I first started streaming, but then my TikTok for you page just became like tip content. And I was like, this is stupid. 
Like, if you're... Because if you think about it, like, your actual live stream is not about Twitch tips. Like, it's usually you playing game. It's dumb. <clears throat> Let's see. What else did I have for April Fool's? Oh, I was just gonna play a game. Because have you guys seen the TikTok live streams where it's like gameplay and then a PNG of somebody sleeping? <laughs> I was gonna do that today, but that's like kind of basic. And like, how would I edit that down? That'd be a stupid bit. I was going to do a fast food RP, which I think I might save for a different day. What I do want to do, if I ever do a fast food RP, I think a really good idea would be um, to like make a fake subway rp and then like donate the sandwiches because then you're not just like wasting food but i know for like my local food shelters they and this is standard for most places they don't allow like cooked food it has to be like pre-packaged stuff unless it's from like an authorized vendor like a safeway or something so i was like shit i probably can't do that bit because, like, if I had to make, like, hundreds of Subway sandwiches, I could probably do it still. Like, it's really fun. Um. You can get toy food? <laughs> like, the, the Velcro tomatoes? <laughs> um. What are the other ones I had? I had. This was an idea that I don't know how I do. I put holographic food. Like, you know the one episode of Spongebob where Cameron is like, eat your meat, little plankton. And then he goes, wow, wow. It's like, how would I, that's like a one-off bit, not a whole like hour stream bit. I have a few other bits, like other like jokey streams, but I I'll probably just save them for like normal just chatting. But yeah. Um... Did I disable calligraphy? I think I did, right? Yeah, because I have to be somewhere at, like, 12 today, so... I gotta go. I'm sorry, I gotta go. So, guys! Thank you for watching. Happy April Fools! Do a little bit of joking, no pranks, though, don't get arrested! I don't want to see you guys come into chat and say you got detained, okay? Don't do it. Um... I'll see you guys, honestly, tomorrow or Wednesday. I don't know. I might, My fingers hurt so much from doing peace lock. So I'm, okay, how about, how about I stream Tuesday, I take Wednesday off, and then I stream Thursday. I think that's fair. So I'll see you guys tomorrow with more peace lock. Wednesday, I'll take a break. Thursday, peace lock. Friday, sketch card calligraphy. Or sketch cards and follower calligraphy. So if you yourself gifted five subs during March, make sure you DM me a picture. Um. By Wednesday. Also, I forgot. One of the bits, I think it was Max's question, how do you milk subs? What is actually a good tip to milk donations? Is to have a daily leaderboard instead of a weekly or a monthly. Which is what I did today, but I forgot to say the bit. God damn it. Editor, put it in post. But yeah, putting a daily leaderboard really incentivizes people to, like, be the top for the day. That is actually a Twitch tip. Okay, I'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye-bye! Thank you guys for watching. This will be a banger YouTube vid whenever it comes out, I promise. Like, yeah, dude. It's gonna be so sick. If you were here... Be glad you were actually here. But thank you guys for watching. Hope you guys had fun today. It's not often I do RP, but that was kind of fun.
Bye, hacker. Bye, guys. Thanks for watching. Wait, so... <laughs> There's one Autobahn message, but I can't read it now. It's expired. Who said a bad word? Who did it? Okay.